Good morning, and thank you for joining us for Tuesday's Daily Market Outlook, brought to you by GSI Markets. Come trade with the professionals. Ample inventories and stable refinery operation drive gasoline prices lower, but this is not translated to similarly lower retail value. Scientists continue to worry that the possibility of leaving the EU will bring a potential loss of about $1.2 billion a year of investments intended for research and discoveries. Bank of Japan decided to increase its ETF purchases from 3.3 to 6 trillion yen due to the uncertain outlook in global health. The S&P 500 might head lower as inferior durable goods, as well as GDP report, plague the index. However, analysts are expecting that earnings will play a fundamental role in future developments. The level of a diffusion index based on surveyed purchasing managers in UK's construction industry is projected to decrease to 44.2 points which in turn is expected to devaluate the pound against the dollar. The percentage that business managers expect the price of goods and services to change annually during the next two years in New Zealand should be published today. A reading higher than 1.6% will most likely boost the New Zealand dollar to new highs. Euro is expected to head higher today as the change in the inflation-adjusted value of all expenditures by consumers in the US is projected to decrease by 0.1%. That's all for Tuesday's Daily Outlook. Join us again tomorrow morning for more in-depth analysis of the markets.